just a moment, you are going to hear the voice of a man who will tell you some tremendously important facts. Welcome to the Reality Revolution. I am your host, Brian Scott. I'm going to take you on an adventure today. I have two meditations that you can find on the channel. We're going to kind of combine those into something altogether different. There is the Big Bang Meditation where we go to the very beginning of time and we experience the Big Bang in one massive accelerated manifestation. And then there's the Black Hole Meditation, a sleep meditation I designed where you astrally project inside of a black hole. It's essentially the void. Physicists have theorized that we actually exist as a universe on the other side of a black hole. It's exploding outward that perhaps all of creation comes from the black hole. So imagine within each black hole on the other side is an entire universe. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to a very central black hole and then we will create our own universe. You can create the rules for it. You can go into whatever sort of creation that you want. And from this point, it will all be yours and you will go from this void and explode outward into your own reality. This is so much fun, very similar to the quantum jumps, quantum surfing that we've done on the channel. So just find yourself a place to relax and let go of the outside world. You can do this sitting down or lying down, whatever is more comfortable for you. Just take a deep, conscious breath, feeling that cool air rushing into your body. Try to expand your diaphragm, your stomach, as you breathe in. Naturally release all the air, feeling the heat leaving your body. I want you to breathe in again. Expanding your diaphragm, feeling this air move into your body, relaxing any tensions that you might be holding in your body. Scan your body as you continue to breathe in deeply. Consciously let go of any tensions that your muscles are holding or pains. Now scan through your body starting from your feet and relax your feet and your toes. The soles of your feet moving up to your ankles, into your calves, through your knees, relaxing your thighs and quadriceps, your glutamus, your stomach, your groin moving up to all the internal organs, relaxing them, moving them back into flow, feeling this relaxation tied to your breath. You pull this relaxation up through your chest, into your heart, up to your shoulders, down your arms, relaxing your elbows and your forearms, your hands, moving back up through your arms to your neck, relaxing all the several muscles that you have in your neck, up through the face, relaxing your scalp and your forehead and feel your whole body just relax a little bit more. There's both a lightness as you begin to float and a heaviness as you sink into your better chair. Now we're going to turn on the engine. So pull your hand to your heart. And I want you to focus on your heart. Bring all of your attention into your heart. If you can, shrink down and astrally travel into the heart. Sometimes you're going to see an entire universe there. Just go to that place. There's a place. Find it. Connect with it. Feel the connection this singularity within your heart has with all of the cells in your body and all of the atoms in material existence around you. 
Breathe in slowly, five to six seconds. Hold it, and then breathe out. Hold it for a few seconds. And breathe in once again. Continue this process of breathing. This coordinates your heart and mind together into coherence. If you can feel the pulsations of your brain waves, try to link them up to your heart so that they become one symphony. Focusing the power of your energy. Awakening the engine of your Merkaba. I want you to become aware of the tetrahedron with a point above your head and all three sides down below your feet. And a second tetrahedron that is inverted upside down, the point being below your perineum, linking to the top, interconnected like a three-dimensional star. Just become aware of the energies of your body in these two tetrahedrons. And I want you to begin to spin them, but we're going to just ask our subconscious to spin them in the proper directions for you. And as they spin, you notice that there is three different ones. Two of them that are neutral that don't move. Two of them that are moving, probably already, to your left spinning and some that are spinning to the right. And ask your subconscious to spin your Merkabas at the perfect rate of speed for you to navigate the universe in a healthy, powerful manner. Allow your subconscious to program and guide your tetrahedrons so that it maximizes your energy and health within your body, spinning left and right. Feel this awakening of your energies. And as you do this, become aware of the stream of prana coming down from the top of the universe. This pure, creative, intelligent infinity coming in through the crown of your head, down your spine, down each of your energy centers, through your third eye, your throat, your heart, your solar plexus, your sacral, into your root, down to the center of the earth. And feel the energy moving up from the earth, a different energy, moving up from the earth through your perineum, through your sacral and your solar plexus, up through your heart, up through your throat, into your third eye, into the crown, up to the top of the universe. I want you to just sense the different energies. They're different. Feel them both moving up and down. As you continue your deep, slow breathing, connecting to the heart, I want you to feel yourself rising from your body. You look back and see yourself meditating wherever you're at, in whatever position that you're in. Look around your room where you're at. See the large energy field and the link between you and your body. And then simply float upwards naturally, up through wherever you're at, if you're inside, up through the roof, moving upwards 10, 20, 30 feet, moving upwards into the sky, looking down on the city that you're at. Becoming aware of all the sensations 
all the information that's coming in. Continuing to rise upward, you move up through the atmosphere into space, looking down at the beautiful earth below. As you move faster, you feel the link to where you're at, but you continue to move into space beyond the solar system, guiding you. You can feel an outside presence, a place, a very large black hole exists there. Many journey from all over the universe to many black holes, and this is one. Feel yourself moving into infinity faster and faster, pulling yourself to the presence of a huge black hole. You can see it ahead of you as you move slowly towards it. Within this black hole is the potential for all possibilities. Everything within the black hole is information reflected from this universe. It is a pure void. Before you go into this black hole, it's important to understand anything you bring in with you, you will see within this void. So you want to eliminate as much as possible to let go of your body, let go of your personality, of all the links that you've brought with yourself, your gender, your political affiliation, all the things you use to define yourself and become no body, no thing, no one. So take a few moments to reach this point of letting go, shedding everything, going into a state of no thought. And then we will move into the void where we can explore the infinite possibilities available to you. Just as God did when he moved on the face of the deep in the creation of this planet. You did the same thing. Perhaps it's a memory. You created the earth. You've done this before. You know how to do it. So shed away all of the baggage and things that you use to define yourself. Now you move forward slowly into the event horizon of this giant black hole. Don't worry, you're incredibly safe. This is very much like plugging in your computer. This is a conduit for all of the information in the universe, carrying all the infinite information available for all the timelines from the reflection of this universe. We can then move out beyond to the other side and explode into a new existence, one that we create for ourselves. So you feel yourself getting closer and closer. You're now a mile away from the black hole. You feel yourself moving forward slower than you thought. Time begins to stand still. A single second can be a million years. You can explore infinite timelines within this beautiful place. You can run simulations of every possibility. 
of everything that you ever wanted. Now we're within thousand feet. You move forward, feeling the energy field around you, covered in light. You now enter the black hole. You have infinite information available to you now in this space. You can explore millions or trillions of different possible futures, different existences, different realities. All of the information in the space of variations is available to you. I want you to identify all of the elements for the reality that you want, all of the different desires, needs, wishes, put them all together. It can be for you and your family, your friends, and the planet Earth itself. Explore all of the possible futures and timelines available to you. You can run simulations with the unique power that you have now. You are still a loci of consciousness within this black hole. So explore this void of infinite possibilities. All of them can come to you. It may seem like you're in here for an eternity, but time does not matter. You can explore this void in every way, shape and form. And I want you to define and create the perfect future for you, your family, your friends. Define it for the greatest love in your life, the best health, the greatest wealth, finding the greatest spiritual actualization and realizations. There is no limit. Anything is possible in this space. Explore it in every way.
Now that you've run all these simulations and explored all these possibilities, I want you to identify one actuality within this infinite void. I want you to define it. Go into this reality and become it. Finding a place within first person reality, holding all the memories, all the experiences, everything that you want. I want you to go into the feeling of this and explore what you see and feel, bringing up all of the tones of reality. Every single detail is important. I want you to explore it and actualize it, bring it into existence in your mind right now as vividly as you possibly can. You're going to create an entire universe. Don't make this just about yourself. You can find a reality where everything is available for everyone that you love and want for the whole planet. Whatever it is, bring it all together right now. Now, we are going to explode out into another entire universe. One big bang explosion from within this black hole. So I want you to hold on to the universe that you've chosen, this new creation. Define the rules for your universe. Anything is possible, anything that you want. And now I want you to start to accelerate your breath, bring it up, start to speed it up. Pulling it in. If you feel any imbalances, you can alternate your nostril breath while you do this, increasing your breath as deeply and as powerfully as you can. Keep holding on to it.
And now you're going to try fire breath. You're going to breathe in and out in an accelerated way as deeply and as quickly as you can, moving faster and faster until you feel an explosion outward. Feel an explosion into an entire new universe, a new reality. Very, very good. You did it. You jumped into this new universe, creating it exactly in the way that you want. You create the rules for this universe. You are in this universe now. I want you to be careful. Don't open your eyes yet. I want you to begin to feel physically that you're in this universe. You may wake up and open your eyes and see a different surroundings. So I just want you to calmly take a breath accept that you've moved into this universe it may appear to be exactly the same as before but believe me it is different you are in a brand new creation you've gone astrally to this black hole and shifted and exploded yourself into a brand new universe carrying new souls from all around and healing and solving their problems. These may be different people, but remember each of them are reflections in this universe and carry aspects of their soul. They're all linked anyway. It seems like you're in the same universe, but you're not. You went into the void and projected yourself out into a brand new creation. I want you to accept this. You may see unusual things in your surroundings accept it you can always come back at any time just through meditation but i suggest you stay here go out into the day and feel these changes expect them feel it you have completely changed your reality and created a brand new universe through an explosion from the power of your soul within that black hole and it is brand new and it is your creation accept this and welcome to the reality revolution
We return you now to your local announcer. 